This video is sponsored by AppMaker. AppMaker is a WordPress plugin that converts WooCommerce websites to mobile apps. The mobile app builder helps you create native Android and iOS application. Hello everyone and welcome back to the new video of Educate WordPress. On this channel, we talk all about WordPress. And today, we will see how you can enable downloads on your website by using this Download Manager plugin. So this allows you to customize the download page and show downloadable items like certificate, photo, image, videos, anything under 10 MB also. So that user can click on download option and get it downloaded. So very simple method for this. First thing first, you have to go to plugins, add new and search for download manager. Type in download manager here and then click on this one download manager and click on install now. After installation, you have to click on activate to activate this plugin. Now, after activation, you will see WordPress Download Manager is activated, installed successfully, and you will see a downloads option on your left side tab. So click on this. Here you will be able to see all of the files created. So let's add a new file. You have to give this a title. So I am going to upload a certificate. So you can add this after creating your learning website or any video tutorial. And if you want to give certificate to the one who have completed this or watched your tutorial you can provide certificate easily you can type in the text to be shown and click or drop the file here so let's add a certificate Here you can publish this easily. So let's publish it. You hear there are more options present like custom fields, discussion, allow comments, or allow track backs and ping banks on this page. So let's click on publish for now. So now my this file is created successfully and in all files i'll be able to see my certificate so here i can see an option stats so if i click on it i'll be able to see the download history of this file like users who have downloaded it and in which date they have downloaded it i can filter it out I can even count unique downloads only. So if a user have multiple downloads, downloaded same item, then I can remove it. And here you can move it to trash and click on edit to edit it again. And this is the short code. You can click on this icon to copy it. And now you can include it in any of your pages. Let me create a new page. name it as certificate download and I'll enter the short code here let's just publish this page and now if I view my page I will see 
certificate shown here and a download option and if anyone clicks on the certificate they will be shown thank you for watching or you can even add in more details about the download or add your own links also and file size file count created date last updated date will be shown here so this is how simply you can create your own download it looks good and it has its own default template for it so if we go back to our downloads you will be able to see templates option so here you will be able to see the templates for link templates page templates and email templates you can edit the email templates also like sign up notification or general email template you can edit all of this you can add new tags so this works just like post in our wordpress it has tags it has categories so that user can filter it out by category or by tag also and on add-ons you will see multiple add-ons for this plugin also so if you install this and you are using an elementor page builder so it will be more easy to customize it so some of them are free and some of them have paid versions like you have to buy it to use these add-ons and on history it's the stats that are shown and in settings you can see the user interface basic settings front-end settings how it looks like so you can choose a dashboard page also so I have just created a download page so I can choose it as the dashboard page also it's not showing up here you can even paste this WP user dashboard if you cannot find your dashboard page here so that it will act as a dashboard so let's paste this code and see how the dash dashboard looks like So this is how the dashboard looks like total download total today's download profile of the user and package name and download time all will be shown here for the user and they can even click on edit profile and log out also from here so this is how dashboard looks like You can choose a register page also and login page. So these are all the short posts that needs to be included if you want to do it cust uh, in custom way by your by creating a page and designing it and then entering the short code. So these are all the disable style and scripts. So how the user interface looks like, primary, secondary colors, download buttons and on basics you will see recapture side key so you can add in the recapture for enabling only the users that are human to login like they will be shown the title are you a human 
type of thing and you can block the IPs also if you have some spam IPs and in privacy you will see the option to clear all the cache and cron URL you can temp choose the temporary storage management to be saved in file or stored in database you can delete the history when user closes the account you can even allow this to not store new visitors IP addresses so this is all for the settings so this is how you can use this download manager to create your own downloads on your website and enable the user to download it so thank you for watching that's it for this video hit the like button if you like this video and subscribe to educate wordpress